Hello and welcome to Electronics for Absolute Beginners. LEDs or light emitting diodes are probably the most popular component for people to use when they start experimenting with electronic circuits for the first time. So what is an LED? Well, an LED is a special type of diode that converts electrical energy into light. LEDs are very popular in many devices that rely on electronics in some way and you'll find them in loads of places for example coffee machines, cars, telephones, power supplies and digital clocks. LEDs are available in a range of colours and sizes. As with other diodes, LEDs only allow current to flow in one direction. This means that when they are used in a circuit they need to be inserted in a particular way or they won't work. If you look at this circuit, you can see that the LED has two pins, one of which is slightly longer than the other. The longer pin is the anode and has to be connected to the positive side of the circuit. The shorter pin is the cathode and has to be connected to the negative side of the circuit. When an LED is connected in this way, it is said to be forward biased. Current always flows from the anode to the cathode. There is also a flat edge on the cathode side of the LED which enables you to identify which pin is which when the LED is inserted into a circuit. The construction of an LED is quite different to that of a normal diode. With an LED, the top of the device transparent epoxy, which is plastic, case that protects the LED and helps to distribute the light generated by the LED. A metal cup is placed on the negative pin which holds a semiconductor die which is a combination of two semiconductor materials, an n-type, which is a negative type of material, and a p-type, which is positive, as well as an active region in between the p and the n-types, which is called the p-n junction. The conical shape of the cup reflects the light emitted from the semiconductor die upwards. This is why LEDs appear to be brighter if you view them from the top rather than from the side. A wire bond connects the post and the anvil. The way an LED works is that when it is inserted into a circuit such that it is forward biased, positive particles, which are called holes, and negative particles, which are called electrons, start hopping backwards and forwards across the p-n junction. Whenever an electron finds and occupies a hole in an atom, it makes an atom complete which causes a tiny amount of energy to be released in the form of a photon of light. The photons are directed upwards towards the domed top of the LED's case, which acts like a lens to concentrate the light. Thank you very much for watching this short introduction to LEDs. If you've enjoyed this video, please check out our other videos.